this panel discussion, I will say a few words on the European Capital Markets Union. In my opinion, we really need the Capital Markets Union. Our, and we really need a well functioning capital market. Europe is lagging behind the United States and even China. It's hard to raise this capital. It's hard for companies to find capital to grow. At the same time, the Europeans keep their money in the bank account for zero interest, collectively losing billions of euros per year. The US had twice the growth of the European Union since 2009. Uh, it's a bit sad that we're so behind. But I don't want to be negative. The Capital Markets Union has been one step to improve the situation and create more growth in Europe. Maybe the next big blockbuster like Google or Amazon could be a European company. I and my focus is on the vision of four countries to so Slovakia, Czech Republic, Poland, and Hungary. Because here we rely mainly on bank financing. And banks, they're great at mortgages, but not so much for risk financing. And uh, you can go to the. And uh, as I outlined in my paper, if you want my paper, I can send you a PDF copy if you. Send me an email. The V4 of the got enormous economic potential, but being held back by over reliance on bank financing. The Lewis business is especially small and medium sized enterprises struggling to assess the capital they need to grow and innovate. Think of it this way imagine a vibrant garden, the plants for the V4 economies full of potentials. Bank loans are like watering cats. They provide some sustenance, but it's limited and often an unreliable source. What these economists really need is a flowing river of capital, diverse, accessible, and they can nourish business of all sizes. That's what a well-developed capital market can provide. Now you might be thinking, why does this matter? What's wrong with relying on banks? Well, bank financing can be volatile. In times of crisis, banks have to pull back. The leaving basis is high and dry. We saw this in 2008 till 2009, during the sovereign debt crisis in Europe and the subprime crisis in the United States. The effects are still felt today in Europe. Furthermore, banks are often hesitant to lend to smaller, riskier ventures. Precisely the kind of business that drive innovation and create new jobs. We have some key challenges. This is where the capital markets use comes in. The CMU is an EU initiative aimed at creating a single integrated market for capital. It's about breaking down barriers, harmonizing regulation, and making it easier for business to access a wide range of funding options including equity and debt financing. Okay. And now, can we go on the first? So, yeah. Now, for a B4, a strong CMU is crucial. It can help to diversify the economies. And V4 is heavily reliant on manufacturing, particularly in the to mountain sector. This makes the bottom of the economic shifts. Capital markets have helped us fuel growth in new innovative sectors. At the power small and medium sized enterprises, small and medium sized enterprises are the backbone of any economy. Capital markets have provided them the funding they need to scale up and compete internationally. Attracts foreign investors. If you invest in Europe, to sell in Slovakia or in Hungary or finally Belgium, you can invest in Europe. One investment place for one euro. So, a well developed capital market makes the region more attractive to investors, both domestic and foreign. This can bring, this can bring much new capital and uh, expertise. Let's keep in mind capital of the accounts with expertise. Regret in progress. Okay, recording in progress. Boost resilience. A diversified economy fueled by robust capital markets is better equipped to weather economic storms. 
So what needs to be done? Here are some key recommendations for policy makers in the B pro countries. Actively participate in the CNU development. Push for faster progress of the CNU. Advocate for harmonized regulation and reduced market fragmentation. Develop a unified capital market infrastructure. Create a seamless system that caters all types of investors and business. And I don't say that government should own this infrastructure, but should encourage private enterprises to provide the infrastructure. Establish not necessarily commonly owned stock exchange, but a linked stock exchange, where regional exchanges are linked to larger stock exchanges. This will simplify listing procedures and attract a wider range of companies. Harmonize regulations, standardize disclosure requirements, bankruptcy laws, and accounting principles to increase transparency and investor confidence. And here, especially bankruptcy laws and how they're implemented by the courts that varies widely between, I would say, the more western part of the European Union and the more eastern part of the European Union. Foster support in the legal and tax environment. Encourage innovation and risk taking through tax incentives. Uh, support the United countries framework. So make it easy for people who want to invest. Don't tax them too high. Modernize the pension systems. We have one disadvantage in Europe here. We have mainly a pay as you go system. With the first with one bill out of the system, it is pay as you go. While in America, most Americans hold an IRA, an individual retirement account, where money are invested in equities. Through direct into equities or through funds, into the private equity funds. So more and more than funded pension systems <coughs> where the percentage can be invested in equities. Right. So the B4 have a unique opportunity to lead the way in regional capital markets integration by taking decisive action. It can unlock its economic potential and create a more dynamic and prosperous future and contribute to a strong European Union. And we can take the last slide. And if you have any questions, I'm very happy to hand you the microphone. I'm not going to look at slide and I'll suggest to hand you the microphone. Otherwise, if you have no questions, I will take the opportunity to thank our sponsors making this event possible. We have main partners, the Minister of Finance and the Slovak National Bank, Visa. We have partners, Dekta, Prostol and Pavlovich, EU, BA and Krif. And then we have sponsors, Israel Embassy, Fumbi, RBX, ESCA, Finance, ESCA Finance, sorry, Bursa, Sendovic, Papier, Bratislava. And the expert partners of Lufthansa Group and media partners FX. Thank you, sponsors, partners, and supporters for making the event possible. Now I would like to introduce our panel members. We have hopefully Lukas Monko online. Hello, everybody. He's the chief executive officer of Running the Stock and Change. Robert Olkolinski. That's what the term called. Capital market expert and means of finance with Stock Republic. Sure. Peter Tkach. Director of Capital Market Supervision Department of the National Bank of Slovakia. Sad Ivasko, co founder of SK Finance. Martin Vitara, the CEO, CEO of Ocasio. These are our panel members, and we're going to discuss the capital market use until maybe. To uh, third or so, there will be time for questions, and you can write questions on Slido, and I will try to address the panel member of your choice as well. Let's start a discussion. CB. Let's start with why do you believe that capital markets you will be so important, Peter? Thank you. Uh, I would like to start with the uh, Wood Set uh, with strong economy means strong capital markets. A strong capital markets needs a strong regulator. 
And that's what I, what we are trying to uh, achieve within our work, which we have national members still up here. Why do we need, it's very obvious, uh, you need, uh, in several ways, you need the diversity of financing. Uh, um, the fact that the European Union is well known and, and it's the dependency on the financing you get banks. And uh, what we're trying to do with the Europe and the art the Union paper says that as well, is to foster the financing to the capital markets. Uh, there are several, several ways uh, how to achieve this goal, and uh, we are analyzing it within Europe, within Europe for several years now, and the progress is very slow, to be honest. Uh, we achieved some small victories, for example, from the action plan for 2020, uh, if I might correct, uh, rose initiative of the crowdfunding regulation, which, for example, in Slovakia, it's quite surprisingly successful story. We have now six companies uh, in the market and uh, one in the licensing procedure. So for this is something that is trying to replace the sort of financing for the riskier SMEs. But what we are missing with uh, the EDAQ system is uh, to have SMEs financed for the capital markets. And uh, there are several reasons for uh, why it's not so. The first is the cost. Uh, the second is the financial literacy. Uh, maybe the third is the environment itself and the so-called cultural uh, environment. Uh, and what we're trying to achieve from our mandate is to, on one side, uh, educate the investors and also educate the other party, the companies, like there is capital. So it's not an easy process. We missed a train uh, maybe in the 90s, maybe after 2000. And the last train we missed was uh, the, the telecom company that should be sold through exchange. The story was uh, completely different with solar. So we are still waiting maybe uh, for the impulse that will help us to, to uh, start some story that will develop the new way of thinking for the people that yes, we have capital markets and yes, we uh, can uh, find the financing through that. What is the positive and good news uh, is that what we see on the super, from the supervisor's perspective is that the, the thinking of the people is changing very slowly that it is. And we saw it on the, we see it on the, uh, on the, you know, Assets that are held by the supermarkets is gradually increasing. Uh, this is the information for the last few years. But coincidence, this, these days it is it is uh, very flat. But we we achieved a quite strong increase in the uh, assets governed by our companies and investment firms. And it, these are assets are owned by Kari, Mr. Zavita, Mr. So. We are going somewhere now, but I have a short follow-up question there. When we talk about retail investors, we talk about the higher capital concentration in the brands, or we talk about the more widespread investment into, into assets. Widespread investments. The good news is that uh, what we see that I think it's more about it more than 50, 57 persons of the regular investments in the capital. It's not have, and the average uh, average uh, investment is about seventy five euros somewhere. Thank you. We will move on to Lucas Bonko from the Stock Exchange and I have a few questions for you. Um, are you there? No, yes, thank you. you. How does the practice of a Stock Exchange contribute to the development of CNU in Slovakia and the wider EU? What are you, how are you helping out here being one of the primary market participants after all? Thank you. That is a very good question. First of all, uh, we, of course, implement everything that is required to be aligned with uh, all of the other countries and uh, other stock exchanges. So we uh, closely follow the CMU uh, regulation and CMU initiatives. Uh, therefore, we are fully compliant as uh, other stock exchanges. And uh, other thing what I would like to mention is the uh, our initiatives towards the CMU. 
Uh, we had a discussions with the representatives uh, from the uh, European Commission, and we actually prepared something uh, what is similar to your paper. We, of course, I didn't see your paper, but uh, from what you presented, it looks like it will be similar to what we addressed, uh, what key challenges and issues uh, we see, because now the European Commission uh, are is going to create a new strategy for the capital markets. So we created a, a 50 pages long document, uh, which is uh, based on our perspective, the Slovakian perspective, and also on the perspective of white uh, EU issues. Uh, then in the last year, we have created uh, first of, if, if of its kind um, working paper about the capital markets development in Slovakia. So we focused also on the issues in Slovakia. Uh, so I'm quite keen to see your paper and to compare uh, our views and your views. Hopefully it will be similar. Uh, and and uh, about the CMU, uh, we also look on the possibilities to closer cooperation. And we actually did some steps in the last couple of years uh on the terms of cooperations within the region what is quite important uh and we are part of the initiatives in the eu which are actually based on the strategies of the uh, capital markets union so uh it's a slow process uh, we are in the highly regulated environment so uh, it's not not possible to change it from one day to another but we started, we know that it is important for the Europe to build a capital markets union, uh, but on the basis of proportionality and uh, with the acceptance of the local requirements. Uh, I would like to go back to what you said about the harmonization. Uh, it is, I would go much further because what is required, it's not just about the harmonization of the stock exchanges and some some laws, but uh, for the real harmonization, you need to harmonize the corporate law, for example, uh, because every member country has completely different uh, corporate law, corporate actions, uh, how they treat the investors, uh, especially the minority investors, which are important because uh, this is the retail and you uh need to have a, a large uh, number of and volume of the retail participation i don't think and this is uh on the agenda of eu for maybe 20 years already is the harmonization of the securities law uh every country has all nuances in the securities law uh what what else is the uh pension product, pan-European pension product. The first one uh, was established a couple of years ago. We do have a Slovakian company which actually created the pension product, what I think is really great for the Slovakia, uh, that we were the first one who created it. But we need to see what will be the new scheme because uh, PEP is being updated and uh, for the real development of the EU, we need to have a stable long-term finance, which is seen, for example, in the US, and we see it also in Sweden, and Sweden actually is uh, one of the best examples, uh, which we can use also locally, and uh, hopefully it will be used also in the in the PEP, European Pension Product. So uh, we need to have a long-term capital uh, and long-term capital mobilization. Thank you. For me, this is... Thank you very much. Now, the word goes to Robert Polkolinski, representing the Ministry of Finance of the Slovak Republic. One of the key priorities for the Ministry of Finance is supporting the development of CME and Slovakia. I'll thank you, Anthony Tuduzny. I'll thank you all of the organizers for invitation. Uh, um, my point of view from perspective of Mr. Five is, uh, as you are not, uh, we are being the end of the work in the uh, to one of you in difficult situation because, uh, uh, on one side, uh, we would like, uh, to uh, make more flexible, uh, conditions for the issuers and for the companies to do the, the, uh, the, the ideas. 
on the other side, uh, we are also obliged to, to ensure uh, some level of protection of investors. So, uh, from uh, the last news I can confirm that I uh, there was uh, a lot of uh, discussions with uh, local market practicing on some of our official organizations. We are in close contact with, uh, with the main distribution of standards, so we are like uh, central with the depository and storage terms. Uh, I believe international and also you know, professional associations like um, securities dealers and um, and asset managers, some company houses, and use ones. And uh, we are working closely with um, our signal, the European level. No, we are uh, participating in the market, a lot of working parties on each one that created a good purpose to, to solve uh, functional, functional issues. <coughs> so, we are not going to have. So, we have a close contact uh, with trans in the uh, air evaluation. Uh, mm -hmm. Was trying to send it to me. The essential question of the question on the minimum was. Uh, uh, how can each one of the member states to contribute you know, to the development of the capital market? Maybe one day, and uh, I can mention to the local commission, I'm speaking to the council before they introducing what might come on maybe, you know, in 2015. Uh, we have a um, group of local experts which you know, have been tried to make easy documents for, for the like, changes in the local capital market about the other. The this document was called uh, our capital section of the development of capital markets. So we have a few two aims. The main is it from our angles to and to educate to all the market participants and to prepare them for the basic functions of the capital market for from each one of the governments. We have trained about three three times now already on each now. Might be used as successful and key to the establishment of the reviews. Um, but we have not used. But we have done one of the benefits of why capital market is not functioning or functioning well. And so, in the mind, in the world, capital market is not going to be able to function well as it looks like it. Um, my problem here is that now we are trying to, uh, to develop the public markets. So, we are not trying to avoid others more around to uh, the story changes and uh, <coughs> lack of so, the entire open markets. But uh, the, the flow of life is on outside the public markets. We are on the very strong alternative so, uh, assets markets. Um, yeah, I'm mean, developing the three thousand market. So, uh, uh, then among the other uh, in intentional which uh, are growing rapidly, and uh, in the main intention is how to avoid to be publicly traded on the stock exchange from the sale of service, and uh, how not to get trapped by the supervisors and the uh, tax offices or uh, from the side of uh, uh, investors. So uh, we need to uh, accept the tenants in the market and like to find appropriate government uh, regulations and uh, and framework uh, for providing investment services to retail uh, participants. Um, and we want also to work on some terms should we remove the element of our full CMU. Uh, they are starting in 2015 now, uh, with the again uh, to create in the Hopical market. Uh, as some guarantees that I would be back to the way on. Um, this objective was to turn up and integrate uh, crypto markets in the EU. Um, from my point of view, um, this was not so I'm not successful. We had five years later uh, in 2015 uh, until 2020. Um, it was still in the market in the same hand, uh, as, uh, as you want to call time to introduce one of his uh, two main goals, and on his supplement to the digital inquisition, for example, in time with Kauai, or the King Finance, you can more accessible to the companies. Second one to make it faster uh, and safer place, but for individuals, the same, and the rest of them. 
on, on this on, uh, on this way to lock up and um, click the book for uh, short and I see now in so we can uh, not need a new model for the question of pronouns which are I mean to know a lot about the internal uh, uh, stores and I think to know about that seems like scan and to know to know a circle of who's who will sell the optic a great national capital market so I can grow general in the world Market to uh, uh, design is just what you got the introduction of concept of bending data for shares of points. Um, just to you know, make them like a goal. I got to know the information that uh, the cost of the critic for Browns was trying to allow uh, one of those right men to deal. And it's also uh, about this first uh, um, thing that you was the main disease of. We are in uh, the push on part of the law and no other working of CMU, so constantly they will uh, terminate uh, and some detail scans, which is when you turn necessary for our funding systems, will not monetize. It will be on uh, angle to find a lot of information from the markets. No, not to get to the map, the data is not to worry about you want to have it in the also the quality is all more than you will see whether this is will be on six million co-printed. This sign that someone can give you an animation also to the video of the density, so I'm not going to differ about US infant managers and parallel classes and it was on to from managers. Because the not is this new kind change yet from our new and from the rule. And you know, I'm enabling the return nest conference to invest in our economy and to add lines. So we do some long time to develop these items. We don't need to sell my drone, the drone on this very cloud market. We're talking, it's going to be the bill on the school. Second thing, I mean, so I'm put out to the release who is in terms of the strategy. We first announced that we were in commission, but not a matter of it. was very, we have issues product, which was an egregious to part never spends. Your client situation is that to have some small changes when we are planning to want to obtain leads to reach out to to the uh, flexibility and to our minimal protection method to put uh, into a week. And the Covenant Commission has then co-announced that to run three minerals attempts to develop the European Capital Market and it was not successful. And the kind of the army is to develop the same how we've seen it. In the, in the form of the uh, uh, same mix that we can invest in Julio and the new chairman is just now at the house. And on for the insult, the preparation of the one of them and send it for the investment government to the one of the two who do you start rolling in the engineer and base your board for this. So, second thing small, we don't have a commercial path on the camera. Now, on the four foreign silver floor, we did something like corporate two companies. And here we have our owners on the web, talking to us how to deal with all the comfortable work to deal with all the people. Already, you know, my reservation to all professionals is that there is some future now that are professionals. You have no realization. If you want to take this as a school, if you want to work on the other thing, you need to find a few, few talents or priorities, not to them to help this. And to take the priorities which will be common to do all the work you have done to the other countries. In um, this year, uh, I think major people have uh, published uh, three important uh, reports. Prime report now uh, was uh, from a Coerta, I can tell you how it means to him. Uh, I was only to listen to his army now, um, from the circuit. Everyone must play its library. So, this is my view of all the other time like this. Kings, can you go back to you? That's it. Thank you. You know, the white stars that you know that uh, leads to a swing to a to a up into to a uh, European towns in in a uh, 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 in the snow towns that will provide you some services in present right. Things for the having to invest a little bit of a decreased so much in the long term. You know, ever being one as we shop at the market. 
Som var Adepoint, som han ville svare av en gång i påtegn av White Connection for Tvarting, så er det ikke vår søvn, tro om han er særlig Eric Barton. Jeg var kan ekte plutselig svare av en gang i hans kjønt. Og neste time klarer vi oss at vi entrer av det. Det vi vet har stedet hendt, og som han viste av en gang. Det sa vi ikke av det snart, det kan han også ha stedet hendt, ikke på så at vi ikke kan ikke se det, ikke på så at vi ikke kan se det. Vi tar en kar og jeg som var så sammen som var og så ringst Så er det sammen der, som det nærmere han så Men det er ikke fra det er et spørsmål til Nei, det er bare til en lens for oss Og vi har sagt om vi har bare sett ut av tre år Og vi har stedet sammen Og jeg vil gjøre å mention til Creation of the Retreat Til jeg kunne ha begynt med Og vi har sagt at vi har ikke gjort noe som har ikke gjort noe Og vi har vist som er Det er som er vinsen for meg Jeg er ikke sikker om det er ikke noe som 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 er ikke noe Han er noen drones, noen av dem var så av de gode matus. Og den ikke er blant det som ikke er en sånn at det er veldig tiktig support for den dødse døden, er at det som er skjønt super bra er så god for kampen med en klokk og en klare av institusjoners. Og han er den nyeste kvinnene av disse, de må ikke videre over time tent, da det er noe for det som er blitt ikke litt tråd og nest, det er så. Og til den er en del som tok meg helt rett i vår sent, du og barn, du og du og du og du og du og du. To introduce this, this Asian program, uh, I'll call it a game of not yet, uh, if I'm in this opponent. I'm even glad that there's a uh, two twin challenges. No, one is a down casting allocation of the house uh, You can see a tell I can measure in, in most uh, member states, so the majority of funds are in the sending accounts. You know, this is the amount which you are working the condition out to use for the finance of the Philippine companies. Now, uh, this money uh, should be cost every to two investment products, and this money, uh, if I uh, have you not know, able to switch it to, uh, to, um, to BD, uh, or not to be used to for finance to go to the projects. Um, so like, uh, as you can see, how uh, often it keeps plans, but we um, so good lost 60 to 70 selling accounts on um, these now, you know, left uh, the amount um, that got their car profits. Um, next slide is uh, about the capitalization. Uh, this is the result of what our affair for the skin cost uh, last year. So as long as you can see, I have no use that. Uh, 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 um, until I didn't mean that I signed, but uh, what you uh, can see, Clive, it's a uh, massive chart in our the development study by Mark the Bruno. And on um, the same chart, uh, it was you know, 10 years ago. So, 10 months. Um, from the water fuels, step to our people, um, this, this has several within. Mm -hmm. you, you, you cannot stay on the same board. We we need most of our. So, uh, victim 3 to 9, this is a measure in India, so I have reports to Jumat Fesnik to the Gerardis of Monster of Lines. One of the team that it's on a team. And first of all, we support in the tunnel set of the rules. We support the organization and cross-driving. One of the people that are coming up in the United States. The Central State Organization of Regulations and the reports. The election of uh, administrative camps in the course of the moment, uh, uh, the one who participants uh, uh, along with other uh, box, then they have only this quote to the Ivatomus. So then, uh, uh, I think we obviously agree, so uh, we the administrative participation, they will not have a fancy, we are on time. Uh, you know, in saying a long time, we said, and yet, well, uh, there will be more dissension on the discussion and got me uh, some other new states. And now, uh, the other careers might will be uh, finished. Uh, I don't think I know the most important will be able. 
É, é, é. Ah, isso por nós o que é acesso ao falso misto, o que é que é o 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 que Thank you very much, Robert. Uh, the next question is about startup and growth funding. Is that a good question, Rusan? Here, or will you take it for my day? That's that's why I'm asking. We're both ready very soon with this question. We'll share it. Oh, okay, we'll share it. 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 First of all, I think the Zoom style doctor and layers is here for the politicians or so. Yeah, all this will be was it's as simple as you can imagine. So, I don't see many easy formats and they will all do the start. The only problem, <laughs> the only problem problem that we see it is um, the financial literacy. And most of uh, this is as the plane you turn and do the retail and that's just just all. Uh, our economy was upon the pioneers in Ukraine, also including the securities market after the 2008 South Sudan financial crisis. And it took some really strong effort, especially for our multi um, corporate bonds, FAs, because we have traced huge history of bankruptcies. And it was really the, the cobbles of market. You see here the same scene like uh, I'm always at a cow or did the everybody's thought and when you mesh corporate was there to but it's up this is a problem and I think that I think it's easy here it's all the promote risk taking you find it that this this they think and to nothing is the same in that the United States the companies are funded only with twenty five percent pay bugs and seventy five percent. This is why the person you grow it's less person. You know, you can talk a lot about you have to more articulate a lot, but you can all change the finance of the people, you can all change the finance of his official investors that bench of positive words out to the all the major uh finals point. But then all the people have a creative to start to build the backport. So this is this is the main problem with incident buffer your face. And of course, old mansion death will last not and like that is an initiative that you have mentioned, it's very important because it's crazy. It was in your people that's why you should invest in acting to you or corporate honest or a fancy develops. You they don't have them, that they just don't want guys that are covered. Like the hell, see, even though this is Texas 7%, it's not like you think about the direct village is very well done to trick. Even then, sir, Texas only 7% in Slovakia. Yeah, that's very well done. That's that's good. Oh, I think it's 11. It used to be seven. It gets better than Germany, but not stable. And uh, I'll just stick standing on um, to insight the uh, uh, market to uh, private equity or what when it's an incident in Slovakia. Uh, it's not because of, of uh, trying to be shown with the zero wire. And it's real appointments are saying, even though you can do all of that at the need that you are uh, in selling these out, what's that on the nature of the easier for us? Uh, but it is the mindset of people we trust in all sorts of uh, uh, to deal as a man saying to her, I, I don't understand uh, that the machine are uh, used mostly to grow the old national you check in the KDL city of this one uh the uh, the divide between the Eastern Europe and the West war is a huge strategy I am so much uh, in the West in our specifically uh, and I can see what well, they are the little of that, and I'm, I didn't see what we were doing for it. So I kept, yeah, I actually checked the public history of operations of that, and the one to them with about three, the banks are the only option with good outsourced gain, uh, gain uh, any sort, because we've been in the stress, and I think you in, uh, it is. Then, uh, trying to get coming for a startup, it's about, we you know, we, what should you have? That's all in cash. Um, if, if you know VCs and can sort of, uh, get high for that, then, 
I uh, you will know, if you can reach me, you can just travel. Uh, but if you get a lot more than fun, so you should make the more convertible products and then you know, before you stock everything. Always. You don't do all of uh, what he is that I've got last. You need to have the object. We have the other means of set rules for how to do it. Um, and just explain, you know, a fourth thing, big part of how I'm here around and I'll do detail on what he has right there. I'm so happy for me to it's the great example of uh, EU regulation that actually could work. But talk about me cutting out. Yeah, we do. Okay. Uh, is there anything you want to add regarding? We talked about startup funding, and more importantly, sort of growth of funding because small companies are starting. Where can they find growth capital? And how can the capital market union help corporations to find growth capital? Even in the developed market like Netherlands. Booking.com could not find growth capital to report an American company price line, which I think is surprising given that Netherlands is much more developed with the equity markets than most of Europe, but still it was impossible. So if it continues like this, we will have a European Google or Amazon. Can the CMU do anything to help this, or do we need other factors like uh, financial literacy? Not only in Slovakia, but all over Europe, or a completely different mindset. Oh, I first seen the question of mindset, and I said, so, do you know, take risks in worse in there? Because that's why the, all over Europe, when we're at any conference, it's a startup, same dice, whatever. You always hear one say, there is no exit in the end. You speak to one time an exit, I went to the wall. You have to go from your sale because they have a huge developed price. It's true, European markets are at disrepeated and there is not enough of them. So basically, the way you start them to get out is to sell to private equity. And that's it, work to your bigger editor. And then this why it is urging, but at the same time, I think that the regulators. And the governments understand that, and that is why they are laying out the American Soviets. And I think if it works, then it's going to be great. But again, I would say that the uh, biggest thing here is probably not working on the framework of the format, but hire a DPR company and promote risk investment among the people. Because it starts almost with the people. In the United States, the majority of investment is done very deal. We saw in Ukraine, even now, for example, when you can work with bonds, why are you training your pastors came here to invest in our law or put bond issue because they need to come and they restricted their few discussions like that in Ukraine or something. But we see that with the Slovak people, it's not the same, they're very, very reinforced. And it's not only about the same as German as anyone, I should have that's why I'm saying that you have to promote it more high. That I said, uh, I see what you mean because, um, obviously, then again, there are lots of IPOs. It's a very common exit that's really making an IPO. It was not in line to buy stocks in my No, I was received from the chart. I know, I know. And uh, so it's obvious that, that the good news is even my daughter's school offers a crew shock in financial literacy for kids. That's a good starting point. Mark, do you want to say something more? Then we'll move over to our central bank representative here. Um, in terms of the growth cap, it's so important for private traders. I believe there is also has to go on from investors, especially uh, maybe not the retail ones, but so that um, you are know, very good investors. But um, I can tell you that the, uh, the Western public will like on the industry uh, side of uh, the market case or might simply because they are unsure how things work in the year. So uh, for me, as a, as a business owning, I'm uh, not going to put funds to say, will I have a great meeting? Mm -hmm. Uh, in life. So, uh, we just don't know. Oh, uh, okay. So, I can't. Okay, well, well, well is, it, is it a new you know, right? So, the um, CEO can actually uh, just help. Uh, uh, a lot of things to us. I've been like, with great. Uh, because then we could deal with restaurants or on the people around the assemblies. But, like, I see, you know, in uh, Slovakia or in Czech Republic, there are the empty lessons companies as well. They need me by not every minute to start by. Always. Thank you.
Yes, so I would say uh, you're very right. Um, we have investors who are in the sound activities, but we are buying the big up or other stores. I think we have to divide the discussion in two parts. The one part is the outline of the Eastern Europe and specifically meant Slovakia. So in terms of the small countries and uh, uh, thinking of people, and then when thinking big, like the South Provinces, we have to uh, talk about a different world because the CMU is about uh, building a competitive environment, Europe, we should compete against the large countries like USA, I mean, I mean that part of Russia, I mean, so also. And we cannot achieve that uh, by just uh, changing the mindset. I understand it's, it's a crucial problem of small countries without history compared to your It's a different world. But uh, if we want to achieve this primary goal to create a community environment, we, I think we should introduce a two-tier uh, approach, which means creating one financial center within Europe that would uh, gain a liquidity that will can that would be large, huge, and the one only one in Europe that should be able to happy. And on the other side, keep the keep the local markets uh, working for those like us to uh, promote, to start thinking, to changing to take small investors into, into the game. And uh, I have, in my experience, I have an example for, we are the country of the bonds, we are the country of the debt, and that is best selling in, in Slovakia. But it's very different than buy corporate bonds in Slovakia, than buy corporate bonds in Germany, for example, because with that bonds, we're buying the jurisdiction of the country. So, meaning that something happened that is going to rules. Should I run better, and the rights, your rights are much better enforceable in Germany and so on. And that's the fact. But when you square by, pretty much. Yeah, sometimes it's easier to expand with the steer if you like the ice cream rescue dirt. And I'm talking about the jurisdiction. The jurisdiction. Of course, it doesn't matter. For sure. Uh, what I'm trying to say it's a very complex problem. It's not about only the question of some few fragments. Sorry. I agree that we should focus maybe on introducing something on the, on the top. Top three main matters, but the problem is very complex and it reaches out a uh, wide variety of uh, problems and the revolution of one of those. Yes, please continue. I would like to only on uh, some night of the group on Prime Minister Fayette's now. The issue is have well possibility to to issue housing concept duties as well as uh, new new reclassings. So I'm going to uh, request the candidates to uh, uh, bring to bring one cut to uh, the question uh, how to integrate the crypto market uh, to the risk cost of all and the security is a challenge not only for us, we saw a question also from you because uh, we are in the I know no friends, no one in our that uh, there's a there's a crypto in our test without the MBA uh, from the financial market to our inclusions. And turn um, uh, the um, analyzing the benefits for the issuers. Uh, but um, uh, the, the, the one aspect that I would like to explain is that uh, we're not going to the issuer who is now issuing the um, cosmic securities or we are issuing crypto. Uh, the need to be well educated. You know, the financial literacy is of my apprentice who are absolutely important aspect. Uh, so I'm like being I took on that and to the time to soup singing card with soup with Thank you. Uh, let's continue the crypto finance. How do you believe a CMU can be adapted to accommodate the merge of crypto assets and decentralized finance? And the keyword here is crypto decentralized. I go I again. I okay. answer is on Elkis. If it is decentralized, then how do you go on? How do you know where uh, That would be the mean challenge. Uh, Mika doesn't like me, I think. And it would be regulated, so uh, silent on issues. So, um, uh, in, you, you can, I believe that you can even uh, regulate the, uh, the blockchain enhancements that are like how uh, ES1 or uh, no, uh, and all that. And then, all like, which is basically called oh. the thing, uh, crypto. I don't mean you can um, regulate the entity itself. It's uh, how can we that I don't know, I don't the answer, and maybe YouTube uh, was uh, yeah, that's going to be a challenge. 
the question is, that do we need to regulate the people behind the project or do we need to regulate the project themselves? Because if you set up the framework correctly, then you know, um, it's a code, it's a, it's a technology. So if you tell us to do certain things in a certain way, we are doing. So if the framework is set up that way, uh, then uh, I think it's going to be even better than the IP that can standard sort of all security as mm. yeah, bonds, ish complaints. I use the climate this down the ocean. Okay, so what are the potential benefits and risks we need to take crypto payments into additional financial assistance? Benefits can be all lot cheaper. Cheaper? Yes, so can it be safer? More choice by then? Okay. But if I want to be nervous, I think you will work so the OP springs account. Here is the white that it's white computed, but over your security account, the bank is I computed actually for Intel Rest. And it is. And having all this on blockchain will save the time because computers will run up the stock at any crypto exchange by this bond without having to add uh, an Ethereum system or uh, the repository, which will simplify it above. Yeah, and certain risks, well, how people will be looking at less places because I would mean, seek wise folders of the wall chain. You are lowering the counterpart is sure you know that about that. But then what about other risks like uh, the cyber crime and such things? Keep in mind, good, but it's still there. <laughs> Actually, it's still there. Or for example, markets for still they don't have fundamentals just to out and back this all other currency. I understand that the daily things about the cryptocurrencies, which you break down to just the uh, of the dead. But back to your question, congratulations. Uh, uh, what it brings to foster the capital markets? I think it's a very interesting kind of uh, I think for all the brain top um, innovation on the markets to uh, that attracts a lot of especially now investors. We, what we see is that uh, the airline yourself using the format and they reduce it it's, uh, easy buying uh, cryptos, saw the hype about that, saw the extreme uh, yields that they produced. Uh, but for us, as a cup market regulator, the question is uh, what are buying? As it goes behind that, it's when buy a only loan buying share, buying the ownership, uh, partial ownership of a company that are producing out zombie. I'm going to buy a crypto, we're buying some belief that I hope in the future I will. So that, that's, a, that's, a fun, that's a fun little question. I know that we can have a lot of discussions about it. In terms of the discussions we have in the s for example, uh, there are very strong uh, question marks on this because of the risks, races that come up, that are arousing, for example, from the AML perspective. And uh, we know these days that it is abused in this way. So we are trying, uh, we have Mika, of course, so it's, it's legally identified that cryptocurrency is here. Uh, we are trying to identify this risk and, and to understand what impacts it have on the on last two. Uh, yes, and I forgot to know all that I have, but many looks. Uh, okay, I think that we will back to um, uh, Bongo from the Stock Exchange, since it represents traditional financing inequities. And do you see the Stock Exchange to be a natural marketplace for different kinds of crypto assets in the future? I mean, it's a marketplace, the marketplace is there. Okay, thank you for the question. Uh, about this... I think that there are already uh, large players and uh, international players, so uh, it's completely different game uh, compared to standard equity and bonds market. So uh, there is no underlying value compared to securities, uh, as was said by, by Peter. Uh, it is actually belief in the future value. So I think uh, we can separate these these areas of the standard market versus the crypto uh, market and it's possible in the future that it can be merged but 
mm, this is far, far away future now. But I would like to go back to what was said because I'm uh, online, so I didn't have a chance to react to everything. Uh, but I would challenge all of you, Johan, uh, regarding the um, Google in Europe. Mm, I'm not sure that this is uh, easy, easy task and the financial markets and uh, capital markets are just the tip of the iceberg in terms of uh, regulation. You need to look for the 90% of other regulation. For example, we, we have a new iPhone, which is which supposed to be AI and smartphone. But in Europe, we do have a dump phone because of the regulation. The AI functions were not introduced in uh, Europe because it is regulated. So we do want to, and I have read the, both Enrico Letta report and Mr. Draghi report, we want to have companies which are innovative, modern, we, we would like to put uh, into the um, companies uh, 800 billions of common debt but we regulate the basics. It's like having a racing car, which is perfect, but you are not putting a good gasoline into it, or you are actually using different fuel, not even a gasoline. So, and the capital market, it's actually the gasoline for the engine. So we can help to grow companies, we can help to uh, develop the companies, but we need to have also proper regulation which is outside of the uh, capital markets and financial markets. So uh, we need to look on all of the aspects of the regulation. Uh, then about the risk appetite of the local domestic Slovak investors, I think it's uh, improving, but um, if you look on the numbers or expected numbers of the, in, let's say, investing into the crypto assets, it's growing. Uh, and why is it growing? Um, from my perspective, it's because of easy of access, which is not so easy in terms of uh, equity and um, bonds. You, We do have a MIFID regulation. It's quite... Uh, difficult to overcome uh, also for the investors. So uh, there is there is a huge uh, onboarding cost for the investor. Uh, so basically for the blockchain, you don't see it that much. Uh, then other thing is the um, financial literacy. People are buying the crypto assets. They don't know what is it, uh, but they are buying it. So we need to just switch the view of the investors for the real market. Uh, so there is a still possibility to do it. Mm, very important uh, point is to have a easier access. Uh, about the equities in Slovakia and equities in general, in investing in general, let's have a look on the South Korea. South Korea is around uh, 52 million in terms of population, they do have domestic life accounts in the number of 70 million. So they have more investing accounts than the actual population. Uh, why? They build it since 1968. There was a first law on the capital markets development and they were building it for years. Uh, especially after uh, Asian financial crisis in the middle of uh, 90s, they switched from the, um, let's say, European banking model to uh, financial market and capital market model. So it's possible, but they um, have, um, let's say, uh, easier regulation than do we have in the EU. Uh, and actually, they are not even using the um, investment funds that much. They, they uh, are mostly investing in the single stocks on their own. So they started to support uh, IPOs. Mm, it was supported also by the government. It was supported by the institutions which are linked to government via the licenses. So they created an institution which, which uh, is commercial, but with the special license kind of central bank for the uh, equity market. And they developed it. Uh, in Sweden, Johan, you are from Sweden, you, you probably know the history much better, but it took a long time to develop it. 
And uh, what we are missing in not just in Slovakia, but it is very visible uh, in Slovakia, is the investment banking. So we need to uh, have investment banking to to collect the capital, to have uh, liquidity pools for the companies and also the companies which would be willing to take public the uh, company. Uh, companies to the listed market. We do have private equity, but uh, still there is a missing link uh, for going public. So it's not just about one uh, large blue chip company going into the capital market, but we need to have some provision of the funds for uh, smaller companies. And it's a good that you in your study mentioned the Polish market and also the Hungary because they do support IPOs. Uh, in Hungary, they've got a, a IPO fund, which is basically a mutual fund, which is taking companies uh, public. They've got pre-seed capital and IPO capital or pre-IPO and uh, IPO, IPO fund. In Poland, they develop it using the pension plans. Uh, in the beginning, around 30% of the pension funds have to or had to invest into local market. It's changed now, but in the beginning they developed a uh, capital market using this approach. Uh, so about the bonds, yes, we are a country of the debt, uh, but still mm, it is somehow visible as something which is bringing the interest rate in the terms of coupon. So. Uh, but there is a still possibility to invest or to change the mind of the investors to invest in uh, companies. But we do need to have a primary market, which is difficult to grow organically in a small countries. But it's possible in long term to develop it with some uh, support from the EU or uh, in local approach. Uh, Basically, that's it. And financial literacy, one thing is financial literacy of the investors, but we need to improve financial literacy of the companies, the CFOs, uh, because uh, small companies usually do not even consider to use the capital markets for uh, development. Uh, so it's something we need to address and also to make it easier for them to go public and easier it's to be able to get funds from the primary market because the stock exchange itself is secondary market. Therefore, it allows to uh, join the uh, one who want to sell and the other who wants to buy uh, on the secondary market. So we are not raising capital. You got right to I'm just in a brief comment regarding the Swedish story. It started in 1976, so yes, it was a long journey. It started the first time to write down less with mutual funds facing paying for forced investments in Swedish companies. Sweden was not the part of the EU, so it was easier to have such regulations at the time. Nowadays, you get a private investment account after maybe 25,000 euros max, I think it is, where you don't pay any taxes until you withdraw money from it and make as many transactions. You can realize profit, but as long as the money stays in the account, it's tax free. So that is how I encourage people to swim in this and make this direct from that. Yeah. And one more thing, we were more or less watching the thermos or com, yeah, which we have a um, comment here on crypto assets and crypto assets is not just Bitcoin as we understand, right? Uh, absolutely. Like the, the, the uh, uh, that should go to a lot more than just a bit gone. And that people are going to be buying, we're going to be buying the equities quite a few early back at today's price. That is exactly the same as you buy a target now called link. And it doesn't matter if it is, uh, uh, if it is credit, I think as in a format token money that's uh, an actual equity. But uh, I don't need to uh, buy the box to set up uh, uh, an outdoor per artist or uh, either credit or debt. You can use a pouch and which can search you get what he was like. It was written by us at all. I'll stop pouching, so I won't seem to farm clients. Uh, um, just... And Peter from the side of Mike. Um, that's very interesting, but so that the future, future income that you expect from the, from the MSN 
is a different, uh, the, the, there is a different balance on what it will come. And I try to understand uh, on what grounds do you expect that uh, your cryptocurrency may generate the profits. It's the expectation from God. Right. Explain maybe. Whether or not they're on the other side and stocks are actually defined, because you're going to talk about that you can measure and, and calculate your future profit making. Correct. But, so, but also, the idea is that you have to you know, differentiate truth pop and Those are different things. And actually, it's still like, you know, a very beautiful uh, instrument called Silent Wiper should create a new problems. And I'm not being mad to that and being mad to your home, but I just love my being with but it's still there. And you can wallet it. Basically, it's sort of shares, uh, or uh, something between shares and part of the bonds. But the, the idea here is that the new symbolic will really uh, simplify the answers of the investors, new people. And yes, absolutely correct. People invest me pre so I totally know those that that thing that it is or the sense is they have a different way instead of instead of and other people who are more like to have this mem stocks uh, talking about the same as crypto, you know, there's a lot of projects that are not measurable, it's just more like the pipe. But I say it's also well something that pre layers we speak about is we we this strong domestic part is how you get Martin. Kirkland, sorry, great. Um, have some more even yet. I see those who that it when I practice the companies like France, Germany, Spain, it is in Canada, and a bigger game of investor. But what happens if foreign investors go there? Doesn't mean they need this well. We have to bring out something here that will create strong blocks of domestic bidding that will have lots of time to stick out. And the national chain units of that it's always caravans with scrunch or even with work. Uh just to say myself, so, uh, yeah, and the coins are something which you can buy. This is just pure gambling passive when you coin or you just born a thing inside. But on blockchain, but the great thing is that um, if you have the transparency of the data behind and like to check the much. Let's say a unit which is a decentralized exchange. You know, uh, museums, uh, you know, the, the volume of transactions, you know, fees, you know, uh, growth, and you can do it something. And in the site, you can do what I see any or I see the other city. You can do it something the same thing without the need of actually worrying that if there are some county magic create is in some blockchain. I could not understand. I, I think we are getting closer now. Uh, I, was, I would like to divide the crypto world from the Digital technology lessons. Oh, and uh, I would like to find short comment on the blockchain and workshop over the days, which is that also as a regulator, it's a challenge for us because we understand that like, like, these new technologies are coming into the place and they are very close in touch with the domestic regulation. And we are now, uh, we, I can now imagine and we will, for example, uh, uh, a grand prospect to what that is to rent based on the technicalization code. DLT down process. So it is, and um, this is something that we have to dive deep, deeper to understand the technology, how to can how to, how can it be um, uh, in line with the basic standard method revolution. I have a general question now. We are let's go out of crypto. We have not talked about crypto all time, and uh, let's talk about stock. Yes, specifically stock. Yes, since I think everybody here agree that we need strong long-term capital markets. To make capital market units in their functional. And of course, practice our stock exchange and bank one role, the ministry can play a role, the central bank can have a role, entrepreneurs like you have a role to play. So, how can Slovakia be promoted as a place to invest not only by Slovak investors, but also the Slovak investors and foreign investors? What will slow them, the PR, investing in Slovakia? Because then this question is open by anyone of I mean. you. Yes. Just there. Just a short, short comment. I do not have answer for the question. But I can also, my observation to this topic is um, the problem is that we are trying to push the developing of capital markets from the West. Whereas in the Western countries, it came from the Because, yes, 
it, it can because there have been companies trading their shares and they, they've been looking for some place, organized place, where they can do it. And this is how maybe the, the stock exchange is starting to operate. But now we do not have this demand from the from the artists on the market. To me. Yeah. No, 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 okay, then, 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 then maybe you have the answer for the, for the, the first question. Oh, slogan and for me, that would be a good one. Uh, uh, yeah, my dog. 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 Yeah, Second, um, there should be a cooperation, a cooperation, and then cooperation between market parties and the regulators. So, as the result, you can of your games connect. Um, second, um, as far as it was to the product, um, surely the capital art can be developed for that is in that. We need to, uh, to rely on our value uh, conditions. And uh, the best way uh, to act uh, this is uh, to introduce uh, non very attentive by financial programs. Because uh, that's an example from Saleka, I can mention the art term uh, for this opponent, which comes to introduce Saleka's early years later. Uh, now uh, we know that uh, this goes very attentive, and it should serve as an uh, example for other companies. We have uh, a response from Jacob at the Apple Island uh, that uh, this, this uh, uh, product was replicated also in the Nelson jurisdictions. So, it is as exactly how we can uh, make uh, investment quality additional smart tactics. So, I'm all casting for this as well as the examples for for investors. Okay, anybody else have to come up with a very broad question? I don't think ask for the slogan, but uh, I believe the cooperation, the regulator ethical means is, is essential. And uh, uh, organizations like Union Space of Kids is uh, will be the materials uh, which should probably well because uh, companies do need to find some SMEs for any uh, reargents, but I need the uh, ground to push and we can land in the out. We can sell our shares or we can sell the bonds or we can sell the tokens, you can sell whatever you want. Uh, but if you make it sort of official and, uh, you know, the rule is housed in properly, the world less and less uh, stance, that's right, and more success stories. If you would just leave it as a um, sort of uh, whatever, um, just, you know, be quiet about it, then uh, it's not really working. So uh, you need to set the rules of the game and we can call this. Uh, but the reason that I know there is the amount of 22 people all the time and special for growth capital. That's uh, that's a huge story. I mean, we've seen that growth capital took this a child. What are you doing? So, so yeah. Okay, I just have a lack of all 20 years. I'm a professor in finance and I would have thought that there's some Islamic war. I think that soccer message is quite well. Uh, I once went to my bank for a time ago and I asked about all the investments of the two. It's kind of fun, you know. And they showed me the other prospect, 5% from no fees and things like that. So I was basically laughing at the boy uh, through the door. And uh, if it's, as long as it continues like that, the capital market in Slovakia will go down. And the only thing that could change this, of course, in the mindset of people, but one more important fact them competition, including international competition. And if the corporation of Slovakia wants funding from the Slovak, general public, they must somehow be able to compete. So Slovak people put the money into smaller companies instead of American companies, for example, like this mentioned over here. Good. Yeah, and how will you achieve that? I don't know the answer to this question. And the good news is that I've seen more and more Slovak work reforms being promoted by the bank, so that's at least a starting point. And hopefully, you can come up with some convertible products in the near future. So, and then people might become active the investors, even without knowing. And it's very, uh, I also have some information about the companies that are trying to raise any toll for the markets. Uh, but it ends up anywhere uh, uh, reasoning, um, it's an international jurisdiction, it's no maybe the taxes, 
it's easier to go for them to use a neighboring country, Czech Republic, that has these uh, rules that uh, it implies. We know some gaps, for example, in business code that are carrying to the public discounts. For example, and again, in Czech Republic, there are facilities, sorry, public companies, so fine. Uh, but it's not their fault because they know about this, but just the question of political advice, so, you know, no more difficult. Uh, from our perspective as a regulator, I would like to, if you could give me some, some hints, some not selling or uh, questions that should be, that could be uh, possibly solved from our side, because we lose all of efforts to, to explain the relation and to make it more precise. From our perspective, where we see the gaps, where we see the problems, uh, for example, we just are coming from supervision. And I think it is our role to do it else. But if you if have something that we don't simply send it to us, because we like to discuss it and we like to promote the problems of our clients itself. Uh, but I have just one thing why I was on very great clients. I think it is for a late to find those fewer clients for retailing as to involve security of power. power. Hey, cats from measure how much when you do that, being bonds or anything, just pay off the price being holding your own securities. This is not. And I don't know if it's troubling of the trendy later when you talk about off auditory or the problem of the things that just come to right here. But I see with that this is talking that needs to be looked at. I can give you an example of Ukraine, which is really behind the uh, organs. But what really started off the security market there is that large institutions like Mayor Ukrainian banks, they uh, provided an option to buy through the app. First, government bonds were easy, it's cheap, we could pay that three euros per month just keeping the security account. Then we pay at corporate bonds, that means under the import promise comments. And we can see that apps like Bobby live in the United States, or there is now currently a setting up and shares, which allow you to buy like factual shares of actual for three bonds. And that's something that is not present in the Eastern Europe. And I think it's just something that you have to, to go, you know, just sit and talk with the base because they have a beautiful IT infrastructure. Talk about this beautiful IT infrastructure. But why do you not have the demands at the end innovation that melody, which I have to answer. Yeah. From, our, from our data, what we see in is that the banks are for the same kind of uh, risk hard clients. They are not really interested in borrowing for, from the small retail clients. Their main focus is for the private investors that uh, have you know, this possibility 100,000 plus. Right. But it's also a matter. So this is a very good place for small companies to grab the small retail uh, investors. And that is something that we've seen. Actually, also there is strong competition very costs, I agree. Uh, but uh, when you mentioned fractional um, trading, we have it in the same way we it. It does not really employ the unknown set it up. Yes, that's, that's it. Uh, so, so it is, uh, for example, for us, as we are regulators and we have some rules, we can miss conference and some price. I don't know how it's a cost to your report. So I definitely got it's possible. And it's cheaper and I'm very sad about it. But also in Slovakia, yeah, there is a company quite progressive in regards of fintech technologies and that are providing their services cheaper. And again, we are in the ETFs and you know, checks. But now, I mean, I would then like to get back to the low cash of the stock exchange. And we're running out of time soon. Let me say, in uh, type of questions from the audience as well. But you are the marketplace. What can you do to make practice our stock exchange and IPO heaven? So companies can actually get listed there and you'll be able to promote this IPO not only to Slovak investors, but investors from all around the globe to invest in the Slovak companies. So you can get the risk and expansion capital and the exit early investors are looking for. Right. Okay, so first we need to have a investment banking, and uh, th this is where the banks can have the margin, uh, because in trading obviously the profit can and the revenues can be very low. So uh, then they can actually have a um, margin on the taking company public. So th this is how the investment banking work. 
what we are doing, we joined the uh, Federation of European Stock Exchanges this year. Uh, so we are part of the large European group of stock exchanges. We are in touch with the uh, foreign institutions which are focused on the uh, capital markets in EU. So we can basically uh, do the networking for them, help them to be in touch in, uh, with foreign institutions. Uh, and I would like to also answer your previous question. What, what can be done? There is no one single answer. Uh, we need to have uh, trust of the investors from foreign countries, therefore the stability of the system, the regulation, uh, taxation. So it's many, th these are the many tasks which need to be fulfilled in the long term. It's not possible to change it, but Slovakia is part of the Eurozone and European Union. So uh, basically the, this is the first and uh, ground layer of the trust we can provide to investors. And in terms of stock exchange, what we can provide and what we are providing is the uh, system which is transparent, reliable, uh, which uh, works on the standards of the EU. So basically we follow all the rules which are in other countries as well. We can provide also the dual listings. Uh, we do have companies uh, which are dual listed. So if company is listed in uh, Bratislava, it can be listed uh, almost uh, anywhere in, in the EU. Uh, so the liquidity pool can be enlarged by uh, taking company also to other markets. Uh, we do have experience with this. Uh, important fact is that what we see this year, the in the bonds, the companies are issuing more and more bonds. We do have on average almost one new uh, issuance of corporate bond per uh, week. So this year is quite uh, interesting. Uh, so there is interest from the investors and also issuers to, to use the uh, stock exchange and capital markets. They are just using the bonds. So uh, if you have looked on the statistics, uh, yes, in terms of a market cap uh, compared to GDP, it's low. But uh, you need to look also on the bond side. Uh, so actually, we can be uh, thankful to the market participants which are using the bonds uh, and are issuing the bonds. This is the first step. And now we see it's working, but we need to see more equity. And this requires the investment banking. Is it largely uh, the second pillar of the, of the pension funds buying these corporate bonds in Slovakia? Or how does it work? It's usually distributed to the current uh, market participants. Uh, are, uh, so members of the stock exchange uh, has all clients all clients, they are basically standard about providing the corporate boss to uh, their clients. So, thank you. I have a question from the audience here, and um, I don't know who wants to answer it. In Western countries, private countries also provide loans to companies, basically, non banking institutions, we can say. What does that reduce the need for capital markets? <laughs> Okay, Sandy. Well, about well, well, first, you said that you see that currency uh, in the United States, say in Western Europe, uh, private debt funds are on the rise, and private debt is a big thing. And uh, you, I can see that the private debt is going out to billions of euro, but still, uh, it's a very different story. Usually private debt is much more expensive than corporate bonds. And equity is a totally different thing because equity uh, allows you to either raise money which productive raise for debt or it allows early stage agile investors to access it. This, these are totally different markets and I don't see that should for fail. Okay. Uh, I was in Kadkal, I can see the consequence of um, the souls of Bali uh, and also in the public markets in prison. Mm -hmm. I do think you have learned small companies is uh, is issued the issues, uh, but that's not about the issues. Uh, uh, 
big thing that all the distribution channels. And it was a change now so they went on so you need to focus more on our revolution of distribution channels because now we don't we, we don't have a uh, lot information about those kind of issues now over there. Uh, in which we'll go and uh, we we'll want uh, we will try to find our investment. So uh, we have adapted a question and we will so we can add that uh, we have all this stuff uh, the bond issues. Uh, so, so I'm not amazing the yeah, we know a lot of information also with now yeah, at release and the job is still good with me I'll be on a little tiny to tell us. Thank you. And now I would like to take questions live from the audience. Anybody want the microphone? We have like two minutes left, so any interesting questions here? I'll be shy. We have an excellent expert panel here that can answer your questions. Yes. Nobody? Does ever ask the panel? Anybody wants to say something? I mean, those final words, do that sound so definitely, but some final words to round it off, and then I will thank the panel. Hello, thank you, I'm Tom, I'm Svan, and he wants to do more at talk, and he needs to know how to be in the location of market participants or investors and you will have need to support the automation of the market recipients. As always, well, thank you for the discussion. It was very interesting, especially from the other side. Uh, well, well, from the other side. I would like to give you a message from the from the S1 perspective, from the European perspective. Uh, it's not that bad as it looks for the first time. And I'm remaining very positive of the discussion because the partners there are have still professionals that are providing there's a lot of uh, information, a lot of knowledge, a lot of experience that we implement in our places uh, in Slovakia that we take it home. So from my point, uh, we, we will be known the player number one in the world that we have to admit, but we are still very well apart. So I believe that there will be some further developments and uh, uh, it's up to us if we want to join the capital markets as investors or on, on Providers, so it's where we're at. We will support it. Our email in the back is open, but I kind of wish it is. I invite you to go there if you have something that we can discuss. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, I believe the CLU or RSV uh, level playing field is crucial for uh, first of all, especially because we are a small country. And um, um, so I think so the jurisdiction will run you about this in the past already to sort it out. So just to go over at the day. Uh, about, about the uh, rules as well. So, uh, as you said, we need the participants to push you, so uh, yeah, we'll see. Okay, is that enough anymore? No? Well, thank you everyone for the great discussion. And um, coming back to your question about just one slogan, I would say that the regulators actually have trust in yourself because you're doing a great job. and. We're often comparing, uh, I see that Slovakia often people compare themselves to Germany and say, oh, actually, legislation, regulation is great here compared to many other countries. So I see that any industry that are willing to invest in Japan or Slovakia can have a real cost in the regulators because they're doing a really great job. Thank you. <laughs> to thank the panel for their great contribution to this conference. Uh, a great thank you to Lukas Bogo online. Thank you very much from the, for the insight from the Stock Exchange in Bratislava. Robert von Kolin, von Kolinsky, Minister of Finance, thank you. Peter Tkach from the, the Mortgage Supervision Department of the National Bank. Sandy Masco, Co-founder of SK Finance and Martin Bittara, CEO of Casio. Thank you so much for your contributions.